it's been fabulous so far. Let's hope the excitement continues. Netherlands have really got a chance. And that's the first big hit from the left post from Van Dorsten. It was a great set, just watch it. There he is, a metre back, great angle, perfectly executed. That is how to play a spike. That's out, it's one all. In terms of their rankings, their seedings at the moment, you have to say that um, See the Latvian team because of their experience are ahead. Good pick up. Watch out. Here's the angle. Yeah, you could see it developing because immediately Steven van der Velde started going across to back up behind the blocker. You knew that the angle was on. There it is. And he'd already moved behind his blocker. It's 2 1 at the moment to Latvia. Yeah, they are uh, seeded sixth in this tournament, and the Netherlands at 30 at the moment. Get them back here, that will help, that will square it up. There you go, same big angle, and it's the same big hit. That's what you can do when you're six foot 11 inches and towering above the net as you go up. Fabulous angle, great execution, and that takes his overall point score up to 25 points just after a little over one match. And that's short at the net. It's gone down at 3-2 to the Netherlands. Our DJ having a lot of great fun, of course. Every point break, there's, uh, there's a bit of music going on. It's all very heavy beat at the moment. The Netherlands really looking. That's not a very heavy serve, but it's effective. And that is between the two, between the blocker and the receiver normally. And uh, there, really good hit from Samoylov. There's a big excitement in the air. There's a, the sun has now come out. Ooh, that's not so easy. Oh, what a great hit that was. And Samoylov can't get it, get it. He tips it out. And that attempt to bump is no good. But what, that's great improvisation there. Excellent work from Van Dorsten to get that one in a dangerous position. Samoylov could not control it. And it means that the Netherlands have a 4-3 lead. And, of course, they change ends at 7. Oh, yeah, nicely played. The big issue that uh, the Netherlands will have is that these Latvians have been so, so clever and they're so experienced. They've been at the top of the tree for a long time now. Had a great last season, 2014. Still in play. It's still there. Oh, and that's unlucky. Okay. Well, Steven van der Veld has missed the opportunity. Of course, he's, he's not the regular spiker, so you know, he had to move a little bit for that one, but that uh, just came so close to flicking over the net. It's levelled at fours. Here he goes. Another huge hit. I tell you, when that, uh, that ball comes to him, you, you feel the crowd getting really excited. It's a lovely, lovely set. Perfect set. Over the right shoulder. Good work. 5-4 to the Netherlands. Here is Van Dorst. Big hit, but it's gone long. If you see the angle that he gets from that height, he's going to put a bit of power behind it. But I think after the experience earlier in the set where he just dinked them over, he was actually quite effective. Uh, needs a good block here, and he's got it! It's off for a joust there at the net, and a very, very impressive performance there. Van Dorsten is having a really good start. He's messed up at the serve line, makes up for it immediately. When uh, Latvia are in possession, they expected to win the point. Didn't happen. Now, that will put a bit of doubt in their minds, of course. Once again... And he's done it once more! It's a fabulous roof block there. And over the top of everything is 7-6. That is twice now in a row that he's been hanging there 
It doesn't have to jump very high, but crikey, he is so impressive and imposing. Seven points to six. Serve is better. <laughs> you can tell that he meant that one. They'll change at seven all, of course, but that was a, a big, big hit from Samoylev. He was really annoyed at uh, missing the chance last time. Came up from distance on the angle. It was a great set, and he absolutely punished the ball. Seven all. Here's Samoylev. Is well picked up. He's got a chance here to convert. Whoops, it's only just a little dink. And that was definitely problems there for the Netherlands. The Latvian duo, they have learnt and played a huge amount on the circuit. They have got some really good scores. In fact, uh, the Hague. Lovin has actually played with Smedens and got second place, but that's another, that's a good hit. He likes to play the crowd, that's good to see. It's that kind of sport, isn't it? Everyone needs to be involved. The music, the pace, and certainly if the players become very much involved, it makes for great, great entertainment. Eight all. Back off it a little bit, but well picked up. Stayed on, well, no, just the shoulder. It was a shoulder on the net. You could just, you felt for him. No, but it was correct. It was absolutely excellent refereeing there. Very good indeed from Jonas Persaneni. He picked up that one beautifully. It was only the slightest of touches, but well done, officials. 9-8. That's a power play, didn't even block out of the way of it, my goodness. Martins Bavins, he just couldn't get out of the way of that hit. Wow. 9 all. I told you it's going to be interesting, what a, what a match to start here. Our second day in Appledon, the third day of the tournament. I got a feeling it was in, it was, it's on the corner. It's going so fast, there's so much huge, huge energy into that ball. Just look at this one. It's a fantastic hit. Close the, the hand on that one. Really gave it punishment. Another good service, well picked up. And that is it. Wow, we don't normally expect to see Steven Vanderveld, but of course he's being targeted from the service, which means on the third shot he's got to be there to take it. So not much option really the strategy is obviously to play the serve to the shorter guy and a little dink lots of variety yeah <laughs> yeah samoylovs i tell you he is a big big animal as well isn't he at six feet five inches Reiki. given half a chance he's doing his business we've got a technical at the moment there you go, 11 points to 10. And again, the crowd absolutely loving it. They're in the afternoon sun here in Appledon. And there's not a better place to be. It's known as the Green City. And it's actually been voted one of the most popular cities to live in for the Dutch. They really love it around here. Lots of trees and most of it is in a national park area, of course. Hetlu Palace, the Royal Palace, created by William the Orange, is uh, very close by. In fact, I come by it in the mornings uh, from my hotel. It's a spectacular building. We've got a, a little Mexican wave going at the moment. I have to say, our uh, stadium announcers. Jan van der Meulen and Martin Westerling, they, they really work hard. I don't want their job, thank you. And listen to this, it's Holland, Holland. I've been told to use the term the Netherlands all the time. That is another big chance here, he's above it, but he misses. Into the net, and of course he's looking straight up at the sun right there. The sun is in the eyes of uh, the Netherlands at the moment at that end. And you never know how distracting that would have been. It means that the Latvians have the lead here and the service. 
That is better for the Netherlands supporters, of course. Home crowd absolutely loving it. I mentioned my hotel out in the woods themselves. Really fabulous place. And there is a mistake at the net from the serve from Van der Velt. They've got to consolidate when they've got a chance, and it's not happening at the moment. The Latvians are playing like they are. Very significantly higher seeds. They've got a 13-11. Dink serve. Here's another big hit. Oh, oh, he's above the block with the spike. It's absolutely superb to watch. Very, very exciting. It's dynamic. Just look at that. How did he get above Smoil of Block? 12-13. Got to get it in. He's missed it. It's no good, that. That's two in a row. They work hard to win the point, and then they give it straight back. I know that the uh, the Dutch are naturally generous, but certainly not on the court. Here we go again. There's the chanting coming, and again, it doesn't matter what Martens Clavins tries to do. When that is being hit by Van Dorsten, it stays hit. It's a really, really impressive spike when he gets a chance. It's 13-14. This has got to go in. Van der Velde comes a little to the centre now of the court. And that is another good angle underneath the block there. So that was uh, really, really impressive. Good thinking by Plavins. They change ends, of course. Moilovs again. Another good hit. But, oh dear. You know, that was really interesting because he ha he wasn't targeting then Van der Velden. I think there was a little bit of concentration missed there. Just watch this. Yeah. Latvia. Got a good lead and there. Well picked up. Well, fantastic. Oh dear. It's all diving around the beach here. 40 centimetres of sand, 8 by 8 each side of the net. And I tell you what, I think uh, Van der Velde has seen every grain of that sand uh, during that rally. Unbelievable. Just look at him working so hard. We've got a timeout here called, basically because of the difference in the score. You can see four points down and... Uh, the Netherlands have called for a time. One minute. Van der Velde has certainly got more to say than the uh, nominal captain Van Dorsten there. I wouldn't give up on it quite yet, you know. Samoylovs is obviously the dominant character at the net. And he has been really, really excellent. The City Hall in the background, it's a beautiful place where our press centre is, and it's, uh, it's obviously the centre of a lot of activity in this area. Lots of different offices, libraries. Great atmosphere. Appledorn has come alive in this World Championship Week. OK, here we go. So Milovs has got the ball. It's 17-13. Yeah, well, you see, again, I don't know why he targeted, uh, on that occasion, Van Dorsten. Because Van Dorsten, he knows that he's got a more than 50% chance of killing it. So you'd think the service would go and target the other side to Van der Velde, but it hasn't happened. That's not very clever. Okay, here's another big chance. Netherlands have made it down the line for 15-17. But that was clever, you see, because the moment that they targeted uh, Plavins, it immediately took some oil offs out of the uh, out of the rally. Good stuff. Two in a row. Soft serve. Again, it was Plavins' target, and it's kept alive here. 
And that is in play. And that is 16-17. Three points in a row from some clever play from the, the Dutch pair. Again, they're targeting Clavins from the serve, and it's making a big difference. Samoylovs has not been able to get his aggressive game going. That is aggressive. Excellent placement. Well, it, they must be Dutch sailors, surely. Maybe they're just pretending Dutch sailors. The block is up, but it's no good. And Plavins on this occasion finds a fabulous angle at the right post. It's a really, really good piece of play. Tries to avoid the block, of course, and that one in front of the blocker. 16, 18-16. It's, no, it's not going to get back. Oh, it has! My goodness, what great retrieving. Ah, oh, and unlucky there. Latvia just a little bit lucky, and certainly by the same token, Van der Velde chased it down, got it back, but of course, when you're, you're really struggling to get position on the court, that's tough. OK, it's yet another change. It was off the top of the net. No, uh, it would have gone into uh, to Van Dorsten's mighty hands. That's a nice little play, but it's still in. Watch out! Watch out! Here it comes! Here's the blast! Oh, and that was a double hit! Oh my goodness! That really is unfortunate because that was building up to be a fabulous finish to the rally for Netherlands. It's now set point. That was a, a, a poor dink, really, from Van der Velde. He could have gone with longer. Here it comes, and there is the double touch. It's set point, four set points, in fact. And there, Agnieszka Miskowska got it absolutely right again. Really, really clever. The number of times you've seen the shorter guy. I mean, he's not entirely short, is he? Six feet six. Unbelievable. But he chose the option of the soft angle down and made it nicely. It's still set point to Latvia. And that is it. It's 21 17 in the first. And the Latvians have come through strongly during the teens of that particular set. They, uh, they put pressure on, and uh, Samoylovs was absolutely dominant in the early part of the set, and then they did enough to keep it uh, on their side. 21-17, it's going according to expectations at the moment, but uh, a really, really good start from Van Dorsten and his teammate Van der Velt is still in this one, not out of it at all. Let's have a look at the highlights here. Great angle. That was early on in the set. And another closed angle this time. And that was a brilliant block. Oy, oh, that was a huge hit from Samoylovs. Yeah, another good angle this time from Plavins. And it's all really, really exciting. There are the stats. Let's have a look at them. Look at the attack. 23-16 to the Netherlands. But the big one that you don't want to have against you is the error count. 7-1. to one, And that is a big, big difference. Serves a little in favour of Latvia. But uh, yeah, it's the errors that are letting down the, the Dutch team at the moment. And the, the beach girls really enjoying themselves as well. There's uh, a lot of great atmosphere here. We've got a we've got a concert venue right next to us. Behind the uh, to the left as we have a look at it. And there are stalls of food and all kinds of little trinkets around. With it's a it's a fabulous atmosphere. I'm really privileged to have come to Appledorn. It's a, it's a very popular tourist destination for the, the Dutch themselves. Here we go, set two. Yeah. Off the net and in. He got it uh, a little bit lucky there to have taken the net on the, uh, the down the line shot. But, uh, not a lot that uh, 
Van Dorsten could have done about that. It's one love, Latvia. Here we go. It's the big one off the block and one all. Again, the DJ and the stadium announcers giving a really, really good support to both teams. Keep it in. He's got it in. There's the tip over the top, and that's very clever. Samoylovs has been around the block a few times, isn't he? You can tell. Just look at that. It was clever. In fact, Van Dorsten prompted him to do that by moving over towards the centre of the court there with his attempted block. He was already going there, and Samoylovs improvised very well. That's out. It's 2 all. Block going to count this time. Oh, that's well played. That's out of. Oh, it's called it. Okay, that is a really, really good piece of play. Didn't expect that, but Stephen Van der Velde this time. Look at that great frying pan pickup. And then, wow, right on the line. It looked a little bit long at first at speed. Then we have a look at the opportunity. Ooh, right on the edge of the line. Good stuff. Three, two. Netherlands. Uh, okay, that was the carry. Frustrating, you've only got milliseconds to think about it. Well, maybe you don't think about it, it's all instinct, isn't it? One more point before they change ends. But the uh, sun has gone behind a big cloud at the moment, so perfect conditions. And that is good enough for a lead from the Netherlands. 4-3 is the score, and they will change sides. Yeah. Great work by Van der Velde there to force that uh, play off the block. I like the way that both Van der Velde and Van Dorsten are encouraging the crowd as well. It's certainly, it's a couple of points. And the, the, Latvia, the Latvian supporters there really giving us a bit of a giggle. That is good stuff. Left-handed, but it's out. It's gone out, and Agneska gives it to Latvia there to level things at 4 all. But what's the left-hand play here? Left hand up, and then the left-hand delivery. That's, that's why it went long. Nice set. That is a beautiful set. He was perfect position. That is absolutely excellent from Van der Velde to come through. That is a really great bump set. He's made a line play there. In fact, if anything, Samoylovs had gone a fraction too far to the right, to the center, opened up the line. 5-4. Well, he will be annoyed at that. He got a good touch on it. But I tell you, Samoylovs, is he limping a little bit? Have a look at this one. Really, really hard through the block. Well, in fact, just to the left of the block there. It's five all. Little dinky serve, but here's a big chance. Oh, yeah. Nice, intelligent play. Good work from Van Dorsten. He's really racking up the numbers here. And of course, they did play three sets in their match against uh, Grimald. From the Grimald brothers from Chile. And of course, that gave him a chance to be at the top of the stats in the blocking department, second in the overall scores. Missed the serve again. That's a couple of faults at the serve. He won't be happy about that. Leveled up at the moment at sixes in the second. go again it's a nice set it's down the middle but what a block great block wow super work from martin's plumbins well he had lots of options he was down the middle of the court and that was the perfect block oh he got those arms together really really well he gambled a little bit and it paid off this is going to be a joust and it falls to latvia's point 
And a single-handed joust there was no good. And Blavins again, he went up with two hands. What's this? Two, oh, in fact, one hand each. Should have been. Yeah, one hand each, that was no good. Good, strong wrists there from Blavins to now take it to 8-6. Some loss with the service. Okay, that's a great bump set. Lovely bump set. And a bump and a thump from the DJ as well. It uh, gets the crowd really going, that's for sure. Okay, here's Van der Velt. It's back a little bit, came a little, I think he probably came off the shoulder as well out of play, but uh, keeping that two-point gap, Latvia 9-7. So, here is Clubbins. He's had a good, good match. There we go. Oh, and another brilliant, brilliant angle. He's played that four times now. A really impressive piece of play from Van der Velt. Again, it's the perfect set for him, and just look at that. No chance for Samoylovs at the net. Didn't even back off to try and make it, but, uh, well, that's a very useful weapon. Here's Van Dorsum with a huge hit, and he's into the net, and that's his big mistake again. He won't be happy about those errors. 10-8. And eight some oil offs again. Just a little dink. Here is Van Dossen, and he gets another big hit on that one. Clubbins actually was not far off making it a really good block. Watch this, he was disappointed. Turns away thinking, oh man, I should have got that one. Yeah, it was just the left fingers of the left hand there that uh, blew it away. That's a good hit. It's under the block again okay there's a huge benefit in the height that we see from van dorsen but he went a little bit too high and the shot came underneath 11-9 Blavins again from the right side just dinks one again from the middle this time and he's got an angle on it doesn't have to put the power Okay, we'll take a little time here. We've got a one minute break at 21.10 for the technical. So, they are close, but they've really got to keep that uh, power play in control through the block there. You see that one? Nice placement. And don't get carried away when they've got a chance. Good second set. 21.17 in the first set. And again, the crowd just uh, under control at the moment. And, uh, uh -huh. Well, there is uh, a Dutch pair at the top of the rankings, of course, for the men. We are meeting Numador and Varenhorst, and I believe that Numador is actually a local to Appledore. I've got a feeling he played for uh, Dinamo. If that's the case, really going to be a very popular... Where if he manages to take this title, of course, Varenhorst, Christian Varenhorst, went into the final of the St. Petersburg Grand Slam last weekend. They lost it, but it was a very close 15-13 in the third. Really, really good match. Varenhorst is he's as tall as Mikael van Dorsten. So the, the Dutch have got some really big boys. That is the power! It's 72 kilometers an hour, that one. That is a huge hit. Watch this one. And there's nothing that Plavins, he moved a little bit further to the right post. It opened up the gap a little bit, straight down the middle between the two defenders. It's a great service. Wow, Vanderbilt comes up with a big one. 
Well, they've missed a few serves, and I've been critical of that, but let's give praise where it's due. That is a superb service. Down the line, power. Samoylos can't get there. Another big hit. So they're being aggressive now. Oh, uh, not quite. <laughs> it's all testosterone-led here at the moment, isn't it? There's a lot of big hitting going on. It's a great hit this time from Plavins from the right post. That's the Latvian flag you can see waving in the background there. They've obviously got a lot of supporters. Nearly got in each other's way there. And that's a beauty down the line this time. Again, good thinking from Steven van der Berg. He's only 20 years old, but I tell you what, he's got an old head on him. That is very clever. Good work, right in the corner. It's 13 all in the second set. Big boy van Dosten with the hit. And another clever piece of play once more from Samoylovs. He just sums it all up. He looks at where the defense is placed and just puts it where they're not. Nice big empty space for him. It's 14 13. Samoylovs will serve. They wanted to see the big hit, they got that. Samoylov's got his left hand to it, but uh, it went straight out of play, it's 14 all. A few of the crowd on their feet at the moment, just urging this Netherlands team on to push it into a third set. That's what we'll, they'll need to do. Again, great atmosphere, 14s, second set. Good service, but well picked up. Beautiful. And that's the block that we've been waiting for. That's the third block now. And you have to say that Van Dorsen, he certainly deserved that. Got into great shape there. Samoylos was going to absolutely leather that. I tell you, that's great left-handed. Strong in the wrist as well there. 15-14, another big... It's called in! Oh, my goodness, 80 kilometers an hour from the service. That is a huge piece of play from Steven van der Velde and the crowd absolutely loving this one. 80k, that is now a timeout called by Latvia. And with a two-point lead coming in towards the end of the second set, that is brave, brave play. But you know, that is what was required. A bit of a smile there you saw from Van der Velde. It's no wonder it was a huge play, very aggressive, and maybe that's what will change the fortunes of this particular match. Apodorn has certainly come alive with some big hitting. So it's still Steven van der Bell with the service and you can see Van Dosten encouraging the crowd. Not that, they, not that they need to be encouraged that much. It's a two-point lead. The most important thing is to get this one in play. He's done it. He's done it well! It's another ace! Wow! That is fantastic. 17-14. Straight down the middle between the two. It's with power as well. Hesitation, you do not get anywhere if you hesitate in defense in this game. 17-14, get it in again. It's another big hit, Samoylos will take it. Plavins comes up, and it's in this time, off an angle from the center. Closed the hand a little bit over, and then got it down the line. Great play from Latvia, they were under big pressure. Good work. 15-17. Here's Plavins. Here's the big hit again, and it's knocked down this time, but Decker time! It's in! It's 18-15. He will go to the line now, Van Dorsen. He was a bit lucky to get that one straight back from the bump. Made no mistake for the second time, though. It was a beautiful set from Plavins. 18-15. <laughs> Oh, it's just on the line. <laughs> okay, 16-18.
But again, the big thing is, if Samoylovs is going to take this, I believe. Uh, yeah, Samoylovs will take it. Now, is he going to target Van Dorsten or Van der Velde from the service? Van, Dors uh, Van Dorsten. Van Dorsten will kill it. No, he won't. Oh, that's really clever play. Well done, Samoylovs. He gambled on taking it to, to Van Dorsten. And he got away with it. That is the one. Yeah, what a good block that was. Excellent block. Well played. So he came from the, the serve line, came to the net, made the point. Excellent work. Samoylovs. Big point this for the Netherlands. Huge point. And another big block. Two in a row there for Alexander Samoylovs of Latvia. They've leveled it up at 18 all. Really exciting. But look at that strong, strong left hand. Fantastic, really impressive. Samoylovs again gets it in play. Van Dosten is there. Van Dosten makes it. 19-18. Wow. Two points from the blocks for Latvia on this occasion. It's uh, well, more or less down the line. It wasn't that close to the line. It was well in. Big hit. Here is Van der Velde. Van der Velde gets a good hit. Watch out. Samoylovs has kept it there, but it's no, it's down. It's out. It's 19 all. Well, it's do or die for the Netherlands right now. Are they going to be heroes or villains? They have played one and won one, both of these teams. So this is a big, big standoff match. He's gone down the middle. It's there. That's a very, very impressive. Three out of five attempts to block, and he's got them every time. That's very impressive. Samoylovs now has got match point. The crowd standing, but the Latvian team are here at match point. It's a dinky serve. Here's Van Dosten, and he makes one there to level things at 20 points all. The big problem that the, the Dutch will have is that they are going to be giving the ball away now. They've got to serve it. So, Samoylos will be, I can tell you, will be in the mix here. Uh, no, he won't be because that's going to go back to Plavins. What a block! <laughs> we love that. Oh, yes. The sand has come alive here with a fantastic block by the big boy Van Dorsten. Keep the faith. You know, you can guarantee it'll go to Martin Plavins. This serve, definitely. There he is. He's got it again. Watch out. Plavins. He's got it off the block this time. It's 21 all. Uh, it's a great match. They change ends once more, of course, but... Uh, it's a very exciting start to our second day of coverage in Appledore and, of course, the third day of the World Championship. But, uh, ah, it's really exciting stuff. Uh-oh. Well, he recovered, and that is not great. That is now the second match point to Latvia. Van Dorsen really from his perspective should have put up a better bump pass it would have then been back to him much easier but uh, Samoylovs now wiping off his glasses his sunglasses he improvises really well so Van Dorsten expecting probably to get this one back again he's not he's got it oh that's it and oh, to the great disappointment of the local crowd here, it's Latvia that will be celebrating. It was a brave, brave effort. But ultimately, the cream has come to the top. Plavins and Samoylovs from Latvia have beaten the two boys from the Netherlands by two sets to love. Latvia celebrate, and you have to say, and it was a really, really good battle. That second set was absolutely cracking and certainly lots of excitement there. 21 17, 23 21. Latvia have taken this Pool F match.
Well, the beach girls will entertain for a while and then we'll be getting the interview after we've seen some highlights of this two-set match. Down the line there beautifully from Van der Velde, but uh, I tell you, Smoilovs had a... Well, in fact, both the players on the Latvian side had really good moments of brilliance. There you go, triumphant in the end. Just a little under... Well, about 40 minutes, that one. There's the story of the match in stats. Serves 39 over 43. Attacks 32 over 42. Look at that from the Dutch. But the big, big problem is the e -R -R -O -R -S -S, aren't they? The 14-5. That was the big, big, big problem. Great blocks, particularly from Samoilovs. And certainly Van Dorsten contributed enormously there. But uh, just under 40 minutes of the match and a really good win then for Latvia's Plavins and Samoilovs. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, the winners of this match, Team Latvia, in a crazy Abaddon, 2,000 people are cheering, almost 2,000 people are cheering. Holland, how about your feeling about the win in this match? Oh, it was great. A lot of Latvian fans and thanks to them we won, I think. Thank you, guys. That was about the atmosphere and how about the match? Why are you the best team in this match? Yeah, but I think uh, guys played really good. I think they played even better than us, but... Uh, in the very important moments, we had like uh, tactical decisions. When we change with my partner, he's usually a defensive player, and when he goes to block, we change. And uh, so I think it was a key. The key was the tactical changes, but is that your experience while you're winning that game and the younger Dutchies are losing? Maybe yes. Maybe yes. Experience that what's coming with the years. We're already 10 years playing World Tour, and uh, these guys are really good. They're really tall. They play very powerful volleyball, and I have they have fantastic future. All right, guys, thank you very much. Congratulations with this big win, this great win in Apeldoorn. I'll see you next time. Hi. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, and uh, we hope to see you tomorrow. So, Martin Westering with the interview there. The Latvians will be celebrating, and tactics played a very important part in that.